everyone. Let's go. The dance class. Are you excited about going to your dance class? When I was little, my daddy took me to my dancing class. I'd never been to dance class before. You're going to the ballet class. Mummy bought me special clothes to wear. My dancing dress was pink. My dancing shoes were pink and soft. You look like a fairy tale princess. Right, let's go do the ballet class, come on. Off we went to the dancing class. Willie came too. Daddy took me to a big, big room. You're going to have fun, Tig. There you go, bye. See you later. OK. For those of you that are new, my name is Miss Lottie, and I hope you're going to try really hard to enjoy your dance classes and listen to everything that I say. Everybody spread out. That's Miss it. Lottie shouted, right, music! Right Music, please, Mr Tonka. Mr Honky played the piano. We're going to be trees, OK? So Miss Lottie shouted, trees! Stretch up towards the ceiling. All right, and leaves. Miss Lottie shouted, leaves! Here and there. OK, lambs. Now I want you to skip around like baby lamb. Miss Lottie shouted, skip! I didn't like Miss Lottie shouting. Lambs, keep going. I didn't like Miss Lottie at all. Me and Willie sat beside Mr Honky and his piano. I didn't like dancing class. Hey Tig, I want to join in the dancing too. Come on! I don't like the shouted lady. Yes, you're right. When teachers shout, it does seem a bit scary. But Miss Lottie isn't shouting at you, Tig. She's shouting so we can all hear her. Whee! Miss Lottie sounds loud when you're close to her. All right, everybody, we're going to be frogs. Hey, Tig, did you hear that? She wants us to be frogs. I love being a frog. Hey, Tig, look at me being a frog. And crouch, and hop, and crouch, and hop. Ribbit, ribbit. Legs up into the air, bicycle time, and pedal. Pedal? Pedal, 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 whee! Horses, right gallop and tri Hey Tig, she wants us to be horses! Click, clop, click, clop, click, clop, trot, 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 trot. Yeehaw! Phew, Tig, that was so much fun. I'm pooped. Your turn. But the shouting! Tig, Miss Lottie has to shout so you can hear what to do above the music. Then I thought, Mr Honky's piano is very loud and I don't mind that. Whee! To the side. So I don't mind Miss Lottie shouting. I joined in. I had such fun. I galloped. I was a snowflake. Now flap your arms and flap. A butterfly. I did kitty cat crawls. I skipped. At the end of the lesson. And stop. Miss Lottie said that I was going to wear the crown. I'd like to present this lovely crown to Tig. Today was Tig's first day. And became a fairy princess. Princess Tig. Lovely. I like Miss Lottie. I like dancing too. And I love women. We've been together since we were me. Splash. When I was little, my mummy and daddy took me swimming at the swimming pool. Right, let's go and get changed. I know, why don't I take Willie? Because we don't want him to get all wet, do we? Mummy took Willie to watch. Daddy took me into a big room. Daddy helped me put on my swimming costume. Come on, take. Let's go to the pool. 
Who's excited? What's that? You go and have a shower. We had to have a shower. The shower was like the rain. I squealed. The pool was very, very big. There was lots of water. The water went on forever and ever and nearly out of the window. Willie and Mummy sat in chairs. Mummy waved. I waved to Mummy. Say hi, Willie. A man splashed up and down the pool like a big sea lion. I held Daddy's hand. We saw some children. The children were splashing. Daddy put on my armbands. A lady splashed with her legs. I didn't like the splashing. I want to go and sit on the chairs with Mummy. I don't want to go swimming. Mummy said, why don't I take Teg to the little pool? Mummy took me to the little pool. Wooly came to. Here you go, Teg, look. There, Teg. Why don't you have a splash around? I don't like splashing, I said. Hey, Teg, a swimming pool might seem big and strange and full of sudden splashes, but a swimming pool is just like a big, big bath. You like a bath, don't you? So make it like bath time. You like playing boats in the bath, don't you, Tig? So have fun with this boat. There she blows! Hey, Tig, now you can kneel in the water. It's much more fun. Here's another swimming game. Find the frog. Ribbit, ribbit. Water in your mouth, spit it out. Well done, Tig. You found the frog. Looks like you got your face wet too. Way! Bounce the ball up and down as hard as you can and see how many splashes you can make. So now you know water and splashing is fun. So go for it, Tig. Have a splash with Daddy in the big pool. Yes, I thought. I like the splashing. I wanted to swim in the big pool with Daddy. I like the big pool. I like the splashing. I like the water all over my face. The big sea lion man saw Willy. <laughs> it's only my toy spider, I said. I love splashes. I love swimming. I love Willy. We've been scared since we were three. The hat. Hi. Hello, parcel for Tig Jemison. When I was little, I got a parcel from Grandad. Inside the parcel was a hat. A sailor's hat. I loved my sailor's hat. Willie liked my sailor's hat too. I wore my sailor's hat a lot. One day, Grandad told Mummy that we were going on a big adventure. Ah, a message from Grandad. We're going on a big adventure down a magical river. Wear your sailor's hat. Wear your sailor's hat, said Grandad. That would be cuddly. Grandad's big adventure was on a boat. I wore my sailor's hat. Wait for me! Grandad nearly missed the boat. Grandad wore a sailor's hat too. Got your hat on. Come aboard. The big boat rumbled and grumbled. Off we sailed on our big adventure. I think you'll find out. I'm the captain. 
Ayesa. Can you say I Ayesa? I Ayesa. A man told us what everything was. And over on your right now, we have uh, the London Eye. Granddad made everything into a big adventure. We saw a wheel turning high in the sky. Spaceships spinning off to visit the clouds, said Granddad. We saw a tower of pointy glass. The Snow Queen's palace, said Granddad. We saw lots of boats. Fast boats, slow boats, and a battleship. Grandad spotted a fairy tale boat. There's Peter Pan. Look, there's Peter Pan sailing to Never Never Land, said Grandad. We went under lots of bridges. When we went under one bridge, it got very windy. Whoosh! My sailor hat blew off. Whoosh! Oh, My sailor hat was gone. It floated away. It was my hat. Have my hat, said Grandad. No. No, I wanted my hat. We'll go to the cafe and get a cup of tea. My sailor hat was gone forever. I was angry. I wanted my hat back. Well, your hat's gone, Tig. Well, uh, do you know what? I'll get you another one, will I? Do you want a glass of water? You missed my hat. I loved my hat. Hey, Tig, when you lose something you love, it can make you feel angry. When you lose something forever, it can make you feel sad too. But losing your hat was no one's fault. It was the wind. No one knows what the wind will do next. But hey, Tig, you are on a big adventure. Big adventures are like the wind. You never know what will happen next. Your hat blowing away was the most exciting part of your adventure. Your hat blowing away has made your adventure big. Remember, Tig, a hat is just a thing. You can always get another one. What matters most is that you and Grandad and Mummy are all having fun on your big adventure together. Go for it, Tig! Yes, I thought. My hat was just a thing. You look a bit happier now. Losing my hat was my adventure. The Tower Bridge was opened in 1894. Upstairs, the man was still telling us what everything was. The man didn't know what Willy was. Well, it's only a toy designer. I didn't miss my sailor set anymore. I just liked having my big adventure with my granddad. And I love Willy. We've been together since we were here. Dobbin. When I was little, my auntie Shona works at a riding school. There were horses at the riding school. Hi, Shona. I didn't like the horses. When I visited my Aunt Shona, I stayed in the car. Hi, Tig. You're not coming to see the horses? No. Auntie Shona worked very hard at the stables, wheeling muck and stuff. Lovely. Teaching children to ride. Lovely girls. I liked my Auntie Shona. Willie liked my Auntie Shona too. One day we had some washing for Auntie Shona. I sat in the car. I didn't like horses. Hello, Tig. Then I saw a horse that I hadn't seen before. Who's that? Oh, that's Dobbin. The horse was very friendly. Bye, Shona. Bye. The next time we saw Shona, I said, Can I see Dobbin? Come on then, said Shona. Dobbin was gentle. Dobbin was friendly. Dobbin let me stroke him. I liked Dobbin. Dobbin was beautiful. I wasn't scared of horses anymore. I said hello to all the other horses. But I loved Dobbin the best. One day I saw children riding horses. Can I ride Dobbin? Dobbin's too old to ride, said Shona. 
We have a new horse arriving next week. He's just the right size for you. Next week, when I arrived, I wanted to see Dobbin. Can we ask the Dobbin? Where's Dobbin, I said. Dobbin isn't here just now. Dobbin isn't here, said Auntie Shona. Auntie Shona showed me my new riding hat. Where is Dobbin? Dobbin's gone away, said Shona. When can I see Dobbin again? I said. You won't be seeing Dobbin again. Dobbin died. But where did Dobbin go? I said. He went to sleep. Dobbin just went to sleep, said Shona. He was very happy. Right. Time for your riding lesson, said Shona. I don't want to go riding. Auntie Shona sniffed and went to fetch Daddy. I was sad. I was very sad. Hey, Tig, nothing wrong with feeling sad. Nothing wrong with crying. Auntie Shona is sad and she's crying. But hey, Dobbin is happy now. Dobbin had had a great life at the stables. Everyone loved him. But Dobbin was very old and his legs hurt him. But now there's no more hurt and he's happy. He's galloping away in his dreams. You'll never forget Dobbin. Dobbin helped you to like horses. And today, Dobbin is helping you for your very first riding lesson. So go for it, Tig. Feel sad, but happy for Dobbin. Whee! But most of all, have fun on your first riding lesson. Dobbin would love that. Yes, I thought. Dobbin showed me how to like horses and not be scared. Dobbin would want me to have fun riding on my very first horse. I put on my riding hat. Ready, I said. The new horse was called Topper. I like Topper. When Shona saw Wooly, she said, Ah! It's only a toy spider. It's only my toy spider, I said. I like riding Topper. I love Dobbin. And I love Wooly.